Hi guys, I'm Katie Wayne and this is Animalist News Fun Facts. Think your parents were bad? Well, be thankful they weren't any of these animals. <laughs> like seahorses, male pipefish carry the eggs before hatching. Scientists soon noticed that babies would go missing and discovered that the father was actually eating the eggs. Now, it's pretty common for parents to eat their young in the animal kingdom, but here's where the pipefish dad goes from being a normal cannibalistic guy to a first-class jerk. Scientists have discovered that dad will eat the eggs if he thinks the mother is ugly. You're ugly and I don't want my kids ending up looking like that, so, you know, om nom 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 nom. <laughs> Well, males find the biggest, fattest females to be the most attractive because they produce more eggs, which means that the young have a higher chance of survival. The panda also plays favorites. 50% of the time, pandas give birth to twins. However, only one will survive. Why? Because the panda mom will pick the strongest, healthiest looking baby to continue nurturing and leave the other one to die. That's so sad. To be fair though, bamboo, which makes up 99% of a panda's diet, is scarce and low in nutrients. And since mother pandas don't store fat like most other animals do, she cannot generate enough milk for two hungry cubs. Many times, pandas can't even take care of one cub. In fact, the first pair of pandas in the United States, Ling Ling and Sing Sing, gave birth to five cubs over time, but none survived into adulthood. The panda's poor reproduction rate may be one of the main reasons they are endangered. Sure, these last two parents are pretty bad, but the cuckoo bird doesn't take care of any of her babies. Cuckoos don't bother building their own nests. Instead, they lay their eggs in another bird's and hope they don't notice. They're even able to make their eggs mimic another bird's. With the love and care of its adoptive parents, the cuckoo will hatch first, grow faster, and kill the other chicks so it can get all of the attention. Although this generally allows cuckoos to grow big and strong, it's still a total jerk thing to do. Which begs the question, who is worse, the mother or the child? Probably the mother, because abandoning children is not a good thing. Who do you think is the meanest animal parent? Be sure to let me know in the comments below. Also, be sure to check out these videos over here. Subscribe right here. I love you all, and I'll see you next time. Bye.